So, what do you think of your day here today, Cam? Uh, I think I did well. Um, felt smooth. Felt good in my position drills. Um, not sure on all the times and stuff, but you know, felt good. And it's good to be back here and see all the guys. And you know, really excited. So. <laughs> What's your level of confidence heading into this next phase of your football career, making a, making a team, you know, whatever? Where, where are you at? Uh, pretty confident. Um, you know, whether I go undrafted or sink in the back end, uh, just being able to make a 53, um, you know, I'm pretty confident that I'll be able to get a good shot and just got to take opportunity and make the most of it. So. Have you gotten any feedback from NFL scouts, NFL teams at this point? Yeah, absolutely. Um, just one thing they kind of worried about was uh, my weight, and so weighed in today at 307, uh, 6'4", so that was good, and uh, yeah, so kind of checked a little box off their list. So, Any other concerns of theirs besides size? Uh, size, I uh, talked about the personal fouls a little bit. I um, just told them, you know, I'm an emotional player, you got to keep it in check, and it's just, you know, part of maturing and, you know, learning the game and you know, just trying to grow from it, so. Has there been any way of gauging or understanding, you know, sort of where you fit and, and sort of how things might go come draft day or shortly after draft day maybe? Absolutely. Um, just being able to, you know, figure out what, what organization really wants you and where you fit in well into their scheme and their offense. And, uh, you know, you just want to have a right fit and, you know, from there just take advantage of the opportunity. Snapping today out of necessity, or did you want to show some versatility? Uh, show some versatility. I was training down in Orange County, down in California, and uh, Dakota, and all those receivers, Johnny Mutt. They're training in San Diego, and so I would come down there about once a week and snap with them and uh, do some drills. And so felt really fluid today, and you know I think that shows because uh, we put the time in uh, beforehand. So. What was best case scenario for you today? I mean, what are a couple of things you really wanted to show people, whether it was snapping or a time or. What was like the thing you really wanted to get? I think uh, the height and weight was a big deal for me, and then being able just to be smooth and athletic in my position drills, and I think I did that. And like you said, uh, the versatility snapping wise, I think that can only help, and so I was really uh, happy about that. 307, how does that compare to like where you were mid season? Uh, it's about 10 pounds, 15 pounds heavier than I was during the season, so uh, I felt good. Being able to run on it, it's the heaviest I've ever been, so it feels good. Scouts or anybody ever uh, tell you the way that you measure up, sort of where that might fit on a team, like what position? Absolutely. Um, you know, guard, center. Uh, you know, I think I'm a little, little small to play tackle, but um, you know, being able to be versatile, like I said earlier, and be able to swing from tackle to guard or center, I think that's going to be a huge key that can possibly, you know, um, hopefully make help me make a team. Uh, I think right now I'm comfortable right there, but uh, you know if a team needs me to be a little heavier, 310, uh, I think I can make that happen. Uh, just be able to get into a different lifting program, and you know here at Oregon, just being able to be leaner and faster on our offense, uh, making that transition. Um, I think you know it's been it's been good. I mean, always always nerves. You know, it's a big day for everyone, but I mean, playing a Rose Bowl, playing a national championship, uh, you know, it's a big stage you can get to. So. I'm um, just trying to think about that and, you know, be calm and just let, let your uh, natural ability take over. If you were trying to sell Cameron Hunt to the NFL, what would you tell the NFL about yourself? I would tell them that, you know, I'm a hard worker, real blue-collar guy, and, uh, you know, if I want something, I'm going to go out there and get it and try as hard as I can. And so um, there's not many more people that are more competitive than I am, uh, whether that's playing dominoes or whether that's on the field. So uh, <laughs> being able to be that competitive guy and get after it, I think, uh, you know, I'll be able to push some people in uh, camp and really, uh, you know, the coaches really like that. So. Yeah, playing dominoes. Oh, I love dominoes. <laughs> poker, anything, card game. As Devin Allen, he really loves losing to me in poker. So <laughs> next time you see him, you have to give give him a shout about that. We'll do. Yeah. Are you staying in Orange County? Go back to Arizona after this. Uh, I think I'm gonna stay in Orange County, continue to train, um, and then from there, wherever I get called into, uh, work out individually. Just do that and see how it goes. Go with the flow. Uh -huh. Yeah. Awesome. Okay.